G'day, I'm Alistair Christie and this is a blog post for LearnDelphi.tv. Now, um, in this video or blog, um, I'm going to talk about computer displays, monitors. Now, <clears throat> I have behind me my setup currently. Um, I'm actually going to add a third monitor shortly, which we'll, we'll look at that. But um, uh, this is a, a 20, I think 25 and a half, half inch, so a 26 inch um, screen that's 1920 by 1200. And beside that, I have a 20 inch screen which I've got in portrait mode, uh, it rotates um, and um, in, in this, this mode it does um, 1200 by 1600 <clears throat> so it's actually um, not too far off full HD in terms of uh, number of pixels um, but I bought this one second hand um, now you can get a um, say a Dell 30 inch screen for um, gosh I don't know, in, in New Zealand dollars I think it's about 2200 um, and I bought these, this one for about 70 bucks uh, off Trade Me, which is New Zealand's equivalent to eBay. So I can get three of these in portrait mode. I have uh, overall a greater screen area, more pixels, uh, and cost about one tenth the price um, buying second hand screens. Um, <coughs> so, it's a, a, um, so if you've only got one screen, go get yourself a, a second one, a second, um, a second monitor, second hand off, off eBay, I suppose, if you're in the US or elsewhere in the world. In, in New Zealand, we don't have eBay. Uh, Trade Me is the. Um, trademe.co.nz they kind of uh, dominate and kind of got uh, sort of first mover advantage um, and so yeah so what I've done is I've bought a, um, a new video card it's a um, gigabyte uh, GeForce GTS GTX 650 and the reason I got this card is if I uh, pull it out um, you'll see that it's got uh, two DVI, uh, HDMI and a VGA, which uh, is quite cool. This is um, uh, a lot of cards um, tend to have lots of DisplayPort um, stuff and like that. And, and um, DisplayPort only really works with uh, some newer monitors. So I've, I've got lots of, you know, I buy these uh, uh, second-hand monitors off, off, uh, off Trade Me quite cheaply. And so these do... Uh, DVI and um, RGB. It's a, a Samsung uh, Sigmaster 204B. And um, yeah, and the, the, it's actually pretty good. Uh, I've got, I think I've got about six of them or so. Uh, I've got a couple of them at work and on various other machines using a, a, a second second monitor. But yeah, they, they do HDMI. No, sorry, they don't do HDMI. They do DVI and VGA. And this will do. Um, Pretty much your DVI, HDMI, and the RGB or um, VGA. So um, that's uh, my new video card. Not, not, it's pretty middle of the road, but I got it because um, of the, the, the three displays, and I should be able to do the uh, gaming across the three as well, which would be quite cool. But not, not that I have much time for playing computer games these days. But um, being able to do the, the three monitors off a single card is, is pretty good. At, at um, where I work, which I work two days a week. I have uh, three monitors for 24 and a pair of these uh, uh, in portrait mode, which works quite good. Although I'm doing a lot of stuff with um, uh, virtual machines and what have you these days, and some remote desktop stuff, and I think I, I might get a second 24 inch, um, so two 24s plus the, the portrait. And um, I, I quite like this arrangement. So you have a web page or something like that um, in portrait mode, so you can read plenty of text. And I do my programming on the other one, so I, I can you know read whatever I need to, um, you know whatever I've googled and copy and pasting and what have you. I can I don't have to swap between applications. I, I just copy and paste between the two, or read and, and type. It's whatever whatever suits. So um, let's go ahead and install this, or uh, have a go at installing it, and um, uh, we'll uh, then try and get the three three monitors working. So let's let's do that now. So here's my um, old video guide. It's a um, ATI Radeon uh, 4890. Um, one of the reasons I'm replacing it is it overheats and it is actually uh, quite hot, which is why the computer's on its side and open. Uh, it sort of it, it seems to breathe better. The, the fan is uh, not working properly on it, and it's kind of an enclosed unit. I can't take it apart and, and see if I can fix it. Um, so let's start. Let's unplug the. I think this is one. Two. And lift that up. There's an clip. Ah. 
would help my channel. Plug the uh, two monitors. There you go. So that's the old video card. Uh, rather chunky compared to the uh, the new one, and much higher power requirements. The other one should um, work with uh, a lot less power, which should be good. So um, let's pull that off and uh, install this one. Uh, we'll get something on the screen. So I've managed to get uh, all three monitors hooked up to the uh, the one video card. Um, I had problems with the HDMI uh, cable. It, it made the, the display a little bit blurry. I'm not quite sure. It was running at the native resolution and everything. Just the, um, the image was, was slightly blurred, TV-like. Um, there might be some sort of um, optimization on the on the HDMI to uh, try and make um, if it's being operated as a TV, make it look a bit better. But, I don't know. Certainly, the, the, clip, the text wasn't as clear as it is. So I've, I've, I've plugged it into the RGB for now. Uh, so these, these, the, the two sync masters are on DVI, and the, my main display is on RGB. Fit on the other way. So there's the, the, the three screens. So um, I think there's about a bit of a six million pixels uh, there in total. So <laughs> that's quite a lot. It is a bit, of, a bit of overkill. Um, I think two is is probably. Uh, Optimal, but uh, three three is fun. Um, and I, it looks like the um, I can only do the gaming across three identical displays, running uh, same resolution. So I might swap this, the middle one out for a uh, another um, the twenty inch screen. Neither have them all um, portrait. And they have sort of a slightly wider but very high resolution screen, or um, have the landscape be very wide, although it might be uh, a bit of a challenge for it all on the desk there. But anyway, um, so that, that's my uh, three display setup, and, and um, I'd, I'd certainly, for programming, recommend more than one. More than one. So um, this is me signing off. Uh, I hope people found this video uh, slightly useful. Um, cheers.